create database statement creates a database with a given name. The use keyword is used to select a database. Tables are the basic structure where data is stored in the database. Tables are divided into rows and columns. Data types specify what the type of data can be for that particular column. The primary key constraint uniquely identifies each record in a database table so primary keys must contain unique values. It is important to make sure you use an open parenthesis before the beginning table and a closing parenthesis after the end of the last column definition. Make sure you separate each column definition with a comma. All SQL statements should end with a semicolon. Here we can see the most common data types. We created a table called Departments that contains two columns, Department Identifier and Department Name. Deput is a primary key, so contains unique values. A foreign key is a column or combination of columns that is used to establish and enforce a link between the data in two tables. The table and column names must start with a letter and can be followed by letters, numbers, or underscores. Do not use any SQL reserved keywords as names for tables or column names, such as select, create, insert, etc.
Primary keys and foreign keys form a relationship between tables. In this way the tables are linked and there is no redundant data.